Alright, now that your rendering is finished, you should have something that looks like this. Depending on the um, shadows that you bumped up, your shadows might look a little bit different, but they should still look pretty good. Alright, so I'm going to show you guys how to change it from this product to that. Let's see it again. It's before, after. Alright, so to begin with this, you're going to want to click on your 3D layer, which um, has all of your stuff in it, all of your letters, and your background layer that you made, and hit Control alt e That creates a merged layer so that you can edit these two as one. Alright, now that we have that, you're going to want to duplicate your merged layer by hitting Control j and we're going to rename this. Uh, where is rename? It's not here. Oh yeah, you just click here. All right, we'll name this blur. Uh, blur two, I guess. Um, you're gonna go to filter. Blur. Gaussian blur, and you're gonna want to go to ten pixels. I know right now it's like, wow, you just ruined your whole thing. But what you actually want to do is go to change it from normal to overlay and you can see that the glow is already coming in there. Now you can adjust your opacity to whatever you like. That's without it though and that's with it. It makes a huge difference. I actually kind of like it at 100 but it's good with some moderation so we'll leave it at like all right, 60. It's good. It's like 70. That looks pretty damn nice. All right and the last thing we're going to add is this black and white filter which you can see just kind of emphasizes the whites and the blacks so that there's more contrast in the picture and it really helps to emphasize your shadows so that you can see that this is actually a 3d image so to do that go down here click black and white change it from normal to vivid light and change the fill to 10 and there we have it we have Nice looking 3D text in Photoshop in what is this? Probably like 15, 20 minutes. Alright, so thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next tutorial.